Picture this, a man who lived life in the fast lane with a pen as mighty as any sword. Yes, we're talking about Ernest Hemingway. This audacious adventurer authored iconic works like A Farewell to Arms and The Sun Also Rises. Now with a grasp of the man behind the words, we delve into the depth of his work, The Old Man and the Sea. Dive into the waves of Hemingway's narrative, where three main themes swirl beneath the surface. First, we encounter the relentless struggle of man versus nature. Our protagonist, Santiago, battles the vast, unyielding sea, his aging body, and the monstrous marlin. This struggle, like our own daily battles, underscores our human capacity to endure despite overwhelming odds. Next, Hemingway navigates us through the concept of individual worth. Santiago's determination to catch the marlin, despite his streak of bad luck, reflects his belief in his worth as a fisherman. It's not about the validation from others, but the self-belief that you have value, regardless of external circumstances or opinions. Lastly, we're drawn into the inevitable cycle of life and death. Santiago's quest to catch the marlin ends in its death, but the marlin's body nourishes other creatures in the sea. This cycle, profound yet simple, is a reminder of our own transient nature and the interconnectedness of life. These themes, interwoven with Hemingway's powerful storytelling, create a narrative that is as deep as the ocean itself. As we resurface from the depths of Hemingway's narrative, we bring with us treasures of understanding. We've journeyed through Hemingway's life and career, delved into the three main themes of the old man in the sea, and seen how these themes shape the tale. These insights help us appreciate the profound depth of this simple story. In the grand scheme of literature, The Old Man and the Sea stands as a testament to Hemingway's genius and the power of simple storytelling. Until next time, keep turning the pages.